welcome ladies and gentlemen back to the geek buddy where we are doing once again another trailer reaction for you i am jimmy bay bay and i am joined as always by the wonderful cammy cammy how are you doing today great like always happy <laughs> <laughs> great <laughs> um so with that said, today we will be checking out one that has been recommended to us quite a few times. Um, it's a, a a different kind of trailer, I believe. Um, a much more serious tone, I guess, is what we'll be coming at this one with, as it is um, The Cashmere Files, which is almost like a documentation piece, I believe, um, about the Cashmere genocide that happened about 32, 33 years ago. Um, I believe that's the information I have on it. Um, I am very clueless on this story itself. So I'm very interested in watching this because of I, I'm always intrigued to know about things and learn from things and documentary pieces. That's the best way for me to learn because I don't like reading. So um, I don't know if excited is the word to use. I'm just definitely intrigued on what we're about to uh, watch. Um, if you have anything else to add. Yes. And another thing is that this movie, along with RR and Cantara and Rocket Trip and Gangubai, they got shortlisted for the Oscars. So we can understand how great it is. And um, yeah, you think it is great for us that we are not from India. To know what happened, yeah. some history, and to give a different kind of turn to the channel. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Because um, again, as goofy as I may come across to some people, I do, I do enjoy this kind of serious st things because again, it allows me to grow as a person by learning from even horrible experiences, um, just on how maybe to treat someone better based on things that they have, may have gone through. So I, I, again, very intrigued to see what this is about and hopefully I'll be able to take this in and help others maybe understand things as well. And yeah, I, again, I don't like to use the word excited because it is not a, it, it's a tragic thing, but I am intrigued. So um, if we have nothing else, we can go ahead and start in three, two, one, and play. Kashmir has never been an integral part of India, and this is a historical fact. Kashmir! Kashmir! देश की तकदीर वही बदल सकता है जिसके पास ये पावर है पॉलिटिकल पावर पॉलिटिक्स का बस एक ही अंत है विनाश बोल तो मौत के डर से मैं भी कायर बन जाऊं पर मुझ पर फटा था तुम पर नहीं पद्मश्री मुझे ऐसे ही नहीं मिला ना पद्मश्री आपको सरकार ने खामोश रहने के लिए दिया 
कश्मीरी पंडितों को वापस अपने घर कश्मीर जाने का मौका मिलेगा इस दिस जस्टिस Okay, I will let you go first this time around. Okay, so um, um, I'm already feeling gloomy and sad from watching this trailer because um, I think it's a very human thing to feel empathy to all these things, and there are just tragedies. There are tragedies, and. Um, I feel that this movie is the type of movie you can only watch once in a lifetime. Um, I think uh, before I have only watched one movie that I was only able to watch once because it was so raw that I just cried. I just cried myself. And yeah. I have a feeling that this is the type of movie that you will watch your eyes will be glued to the screen, but you you will not be able to watch again. Because it is just tragedy. Even now, I don't feel like rewatching the trailer because it is very raw. Yeah. It is very raw and hard. Very hard to digest. And I think cinema is not only for making you laugh or making you happy. But it's also a way of educating people about what happened. And history has a way of teaching us to avoid making mistakes yes. in the future. So I feel like even if you're not Indian, if you're not that from that region, this is a must watch movie that you will learn. You will learn and simply take out your emotions as a human being. And um, I will not give this a rating. No. Um, this is the type of uh, trailer and movie that you are no one to give a a rating. It yeah, is it, beyond that. It, it, it's not for grading. It's it's for again just educational purposes, if nothing more. Uh, so to grade something like that, it would be. I'm glad we're on the same page there. Uh, you br you bring up like empathy, and I am a very very empathetic person. Like, I I cry a lot when I watch things because I feel, and like you were saying, they're not just meant for fun um, or things like that. Movies are meant to make you feel. That's how I've always felt about it. Um, and I've always kind of felt bad for movies like this in the for the fact that there are people who went through it that now have to kind of relive it. Um, and some people don't want to, and it's very understandable. But at the same time, I think it's very important that these kind of movies or documentaries or things like that, they do get made so that those who are ignorant to other things around the world, such as myself, they have the opportunity to uh, have it at their disposable, uh, disposal and learn from them and uh, possibly grow as human beings. And I think this is definitely the kind of film i won't even call it a movie I'll, I'll call it a film that um i can i can watch i i, I will that like i was just getting feelings just watching it so i know that it's going to happen watching it 
Um, but again, I always think that's a good thing because it allows me to just get a sliver of the the pain that this kind of thing caused other human beings such as myself. So uh, again, no, no grade. You don't grade things like this. Absolutely not. Uh, it Raw is a great word to define it. Um, real. It, it's just, it just gave me that just, wow, this... This is going to be tough to watch, but I do want to watch it. Not tough in the aspect that it looks bad, or just tough that, again, it's so raw, it's so real, and it's just going to it, it's going to bother uh, me watching yeah. things like this happen to people who it didn't deserve to happen to. So, um, yeah, I, that was that was that was powerful. Um, it was shortlisted. You said for the the Oscars? Is that what it was? Yes. Um, okay. I'm glad it's getting that kind of recognition as well, so that maybe others will that aren't as privy to the Indian cinema that maybe it'll catch their radar and more people can watch. Because I feel like a lot of people movies like this or films like this should be watched by the masses. Like even if you're not a movie person, you should be watching things like this. Again, it helps you grow as a human being. Um, with that. I don't think I have anything else to add. Um, I do want to see it. That, that's that's the gist of it. Uh, no comment of the day today. I think the tone is different today. I don't think we can we should dive into anything of that nature. Um, so with that, I'll swing it over to you, and we can ride on out of the show. Okay, guys. So like always, thank you for watching. Thank you for enjoying with us and helping us also discover different things. Because as we said, lately we have been reacting to action movies, comedy. This is uh, a bit different, very different in reality, very different movie. And we love it. We love it as for the fact that we are able not to only laugh or enjoy a moment, but to learn. Which I think is something that most movies are not able to accomplish but this movie 100 percent it will do so thank you guys for your recommendations just remember always we upload content every single day thank you for everything and 